be right back. I am in middle of story. So then I am crossing live life, wearing nothing but a smile. When the out comes, it, the most dangerous of all sea monsters, a mire lurk. A mire lurk? Come on. That's like two out of ten points of danger tops. Now, if you want to talk something really deadly. Jim! Oh, I forgot you were there, Yefi. What is it? You know what? Never mind. I'll handle it myself. <sighs> Jesus, Bar? I killed a man for it. <laughs> no, no. I kid. I kid. <laughs> hmm? So, this your bar? Damn straight it is. My brother Yefim and I make the best moonshine in the entire Commonwealth. We call it Bobrov's Best. Had to start renting out rooms just so customers uh, had a place to safely pass out after drinking it. <laughs> I've got a few minutes to browse. Mu Music to my ears. Hey there. Hey, is it true? You're recruiting workers for a new settlement? I might be interested, provided you're actually a carpenter and not, you know, an institute spy. Do I look like a carpenter to you? So does that mean you are a spy? But then why would you admit it? I'm so confused. Anyways, I want to work on a settlement. Carpenters build settlements. If you know of one, maybe you could point me in the right direction? I'll think about it. Hey. Oh, I gotta find some work. Any work. Grunt work, office work, just something with the word work in it. What do you think about coming to work for me? Really? Oh, you're a lifesaver. Uh, I'll be there by tomorrow morning. Just point the way. Oh, on second thought, a map in some directions might be better. Don't want to get lost. Hi. Are things all right between us? Hello there. My name's Alan. You may be just what I need. Are you free to talk for a bit? I've asked everyone around here, but no dice. I'm a cartographer. That means I make maps. I've been exploring our great former America for some time now, trying to create the best route available to reunite the country with itself. But apparently, no one knows how to get anywhere. I guess it's up to me, right? Let me ask you this. Would you use a map of a region if I made one? Sounds handy. Well, I make the best ones. Not that I've seen anyone else doing it. Well, you look like a traveler to me. That's good. That's good. Wait, is that a Pip-Boy? Where'd you get that? Wait, actually, no, don't answer that. <clears throat> I'll be straight with you. I'm looking for someone to accompany me through the Commonwealth. I need to make more maps of this region and I just got to this place. And that Pip-Boy of yours could help a lot on exploring the places. If you haven't gone anywhere recently, then we can travel together. Find some places to mark on my map, and yours as well. I'm listening. Oh wow, that's better than I expected. You get some backup to help you when you need it, watch your back, and things like that. And I get to check out all the places here on the Commonwealth. I think it's a win-win for the both of us. So, what do you say? Oh, but you have someone following you already. Damn. Well, I'll ask you anyway. What do you say? Can I ask you some questions? Questions? What sort of questions? We're in the middle of nowhere. 
Why does it matter? I want us to be connected, like the old days. Or so I'm told. Since I was a kid, I always liked staring at globes or looking into atlas books. So many places to discover. The old America, Europe... Though I guess Europe is out of reach now. Then people ask you, like, how do I get to the Zion National Park? And you would say, what's that? Some folks know how to get there, but they won't give you a good explanation or give out very vague directions. Look for a tree near the riverbank. Well, no shit, because there's tons of trees here in the Commonwealth and several riverbanks too. In those cases, you need a map. Not you specifically. That pit boy is really handy. But what about the common folk? The caravaneers? Even raiders need maps sometimes. So, that's when I realized, when I'm exploring places, I'm mapping every single detail possible. That's me, pretty much. Well, um... Where did you live? New Vegas, born and raised. I've also been into the Boneyard and in the Hub. Did some trading there. Fun place. Walked for a bit on the Zion National Park and went to see the ruins of Salt Lake City. Just came from the Capital Wasteland. A real mess. It's an endless battle between steel and super mutants. You probably don't know any of those places, but it's okay. What do you hope to find? I have no idea, actually. I recently passed through the Capital Wasteland and it's a mess. Full of Brotherhood people. Then I came here and found out about the Institute. Artificial humans? Damn. I certainly wasn't expecting that. They say that people are being replaced with synthetic copies. That's insane. My gut says that we're gonna find super mutants. They're like those giant roaches. They're all over the place. Here, in Capital Wasteland, even back on the West Coast. Raiders, I already bumped into some of them. Organized raiders or mercenaries? Uh, probably. Not much of a difference there. And common folk, like you and me. Which is good, since I found out about them already, as you can see. That was it. Alright, so, what do you say? Sure thing. Alright, time to explore then. Piper. Head my way? You sure you want to travel with me? Well, it's that or get back to writing the paper. I guess the paper can wait. You know what? <sighs> Never mind. You know where to find me. So, want to get a beer as we explore? I could use something refreshing. <clears throat> Miss? Hi there. You can order drinks and food here or at the bar. Who owns this bar, anyway? The Bobrov brothers picked this place up a few years ago. Uh, Vadim Bobrov is the loud one, Yefim Bobrov is the quiet one, and I'm the one that has to listen to them argue with each other all day. I'll take a look, sure. Everything's cooked or brewed here. Newcomer, huh? Talk to Abby. Excuse me. So, I just quit my job. Don't get me wrong, it's kind of shitty. Still, I'd feel better about the decision if I didn't need the money to, you know, eat. I'll think about it. Hey there. Oh, a customer. Need a room? What's the story with this place? Not much to say. We sell food, drink, and rooms. Mainly for traders that come to the area. 
My brother Vadim runs the bar. Scarlet's our waitress, and she helps me keep the rooms clean. As much as they can be. Deal. You're in room two, just through the door. Thoughts? If you don't feel like carrying stuff, just give it to me. People back home used to call me Miss Luggage. What are you thinking about? Hey, uh, this might seem random, but have you ever had fried shrimp before? I remember reading about it, and I kind of want to know how it tastes like. Are things all right between us? We're okay. Nothing more, nothing less. What are you thinking about? Do you know where I could find a pencil? Not just any pencil, a special one. Exclusive for map making. Hmm. Nothing else for now. Sure. Scarlet, if you're hungry, we sell food, but usually people just order drinks. Who owns this bar, anyway? The Bobrov brothers picked this place up a few years ago. Uh, Vadim Bobrov is the loud one, Yefim Bobrov is the quiet one, and I'm the one that has to listen to them argue with each other all day. Not interested. Let me know if you change your mind. What's your story? Mercenary? Caravan guard? Blood, bullets, and money. All the way. Right? Well, maybe not so much the blood part if you can help it, but I hear you. Anyway, I'm just kicking back and sharing stories while I'm between things. I've been all over, seen vaults, pre-war ruins, and plenty of monsters. You've been to a vault? Yeah. Ever heard of Vault 81? They're standoffish, but every once in a while, they'll let new people in. So you explore old ruins? Last place I was going to check out was Salem. Real old town far to the north. Never made it, though. Got a bad feeling about that area. Let's hear your best monster story. I'm from Diamond City. You want to talk something really scary? It's the Institute in their sense. Don't go to University Point. Trust me, you don't want to know what they're capable of. See you around, Hawthorne. Later. <laughs> 